while you're in the first five seconds of the video, go ahead, like, and subscribe. Sure, more than the creator! But now we worship and serve the creature. God made the creature. God made the white man. When we serve the white man, we serve God. That's right. That's why we worship on Sunday. Because the white man said, worship on Sunday. The Bible says, worship on Saturday. Why do we serve the creature more than we serve the creator? The creator created you. We gave you give him no love back. Shall thou be in the city? Curse shall we build the city. We curse in the city of Chicago. We our neighborhoods is the dirtiest. Because we hate ourselves and we hate each other. So our neighborhoods is going to be the dirtiest because don't nobody give a damn. We That's and right. curse shall thou be in the field. Read it from the top again. Curse shall thou be in the city. We got the poorest living conditions, the nastiest stores. These white people don't give a damn about us. That's right. But here we are. We think everything good. Normal life, we are supposed to be. We know you ain't God made it for us. We ain't chosen people, but we don't know that. What? We'll rather stay a nigga. We'll rather stay a fox. We. And curse shall now be in the field. And curse shall we be in the field. We'll curse in the field. Everything they've brought us over, we've been chosen in the field. Thinking God, sugar cane, rice, tobacco, fruit. We've been cursed in the field ever since they came over here. That's right. That's right. I saw the king of brothers been cursed in the field ever since the white man came over here. We've been cursed in the field ever since they brought us over here. And we still cursed. Look at the jobs we got to do. We struggling paycheck to paycheck every damn week. Every damn week we struggling. But they asses over there living in these big ass houses. Because we making money for them. Every time we make, we give it back to them. Why? We want to buy things like big real, like the white man, like this stuff. We come from nothing, so we want to look like we something. We are something. Go back to doing around it. We are something, son. We are something, bro. We don't need nothing to make the chicken out of something. We don't need jewelry. We don't need big man. That's right. We don't need big man. Now I say we got to fucking For now, our unholy people unto the Lord thy God. The Lord thy God has chosen thee to be a special people. We special. We special to God. We the only one special to That's right. nobody else. That's, right. That's right. We don't know that. We are to himself among all people. Among all people. Go back to 28. We special among all people. But we at the bottom of society. If we want to follow the religion of another nationality, we want to break God's side by selling and buying. More wicked ass mothers say that they need to end the Bible. This world called us that curse. This world called us that curse. We curse shall now be in the city. So we curse in the city. We curse in the city because we have no knowledge of God. Come on. And curse shall now be in the field. We curse, period, because of the trash that we listen to. We listen to all this garbage ass music that the white man promoted on our radio station. So we listen to that trash and it messes up our minds. So we gotta come away from that stuff. We are special people to God. Come on. Curse shall be thy basket and thy storehouse. Curse. We got we own our businesses, small businesses, but they don't make a lot of money. Why? We gotta get all our resources from the other nations. That's right. We have no power in this world. We trap it week for week, trying to maintain, trying to live. But we comfortable with that. Instead of knowing that we the greatest people on earth. Step down to 32. That's right. Step down to 32. Come on. Verse 32. Thy son and thy daughter shall be given unto another people. I'm still doing that to this day. They did it back to slavery when they took our kids from us and sold them to another plantation. We were not but herders and breeders. That's all we was. We was like cattle to them. Bring it out. Make babies. And I'm going to make me some money. We was property. We was nothing. And we still... We're still being treated like nothing today. Breathe. 
And then I saw look and fail with longing for them all the day long. The DCFS come to our house, hey, come on, take your daughter, your son. What you gonna do? Ain't nothing you gonna do. They taking our children at the border. The border of Mexico and America. We ain't got no strength in our might. Ain't nothing we can do to get them back. Win it again. Thy son and thy daughter shall be given unto another people. Our children are being thrown in these jails. Let's give it to another people to rule over them. We have no power, not even the court system. We have no power to do nothing. That's why the Bible says we got to come from above them and be these That's right. But That's right. We got to come under God's law to command. We got to come back to our true nationality. You see show your history like You ever heard that? That's right. We gotta wake up. We gotta wake up. We gotta stop telling people. Hey. We gotta stop telling all the stuff about us. Give me that ecological school in This is the curse. This is the curse that we are. We refuse to keep God's law to command. We rather listen to what this society, which has oppressed us since we've been here, we rather follow that. Bring it out. Hey, bro. Did your mother stay in the Bible? Did your mother stay in the Bible? No, it's not in the Bible. That's a man-made religion or a man-made custom, a man-made tradition. They made that up so they could take money out of our pockets. We're supposed to honor our father and mother every day. Every day. Right. The Bible says if we honor them, we have a long life. We don't understand what's going on. Read that. Beware! Let's Call see it. If read it. This is the book of Colossians, chapter 2, and verse 8. So, we, so we're going into the book of Colossians, right? This is another book written by Paul. Because we like to follow the world's traditions. We like to follow all the stuff that these people put in front of us. We don't even care what it is. Bring it out. We just see it on the calendar. And we start moving. That's what we should have. Come on. Beware! Listen! Oh, read it. The book of Colossians, chapter 2, and verse 8. Beware! Right there, Beware! Beware! If you hear anything that says beware, you're supposed to look. Pay attention, because something ain't right. Something is not right. Read! Lest any man spoil you through philosophy and vain deceit. Read that part again. Any man spoil you. If any man spoil you, he take from you. All these little homework. Uh, this is what the white man put in place and spoils up. Right. And take the money on our pocket. Through philosophy! Through philosophy! Where's philosophy? You think I want to blow mother on this day? I declare this Mother's Day. Who the hell is he? He ain't God. The white man is not God. Jesus is now white. Read! And out. vain to see! And vain to see! All that shit is lies. Mother Day is a lie. Father's Day is a lie. Christmas is a lie. Easter is a lie. All that is lies. Come on. Enter the tradition of men. Enter the tradition of men. That's a white man's tradition. Mother's Day is a white man's tradition. Why are we giving them our money? Why? It ain't of the Bible. Why are we giving the white man our money? Talk about celebrating Mother's Day. He told us that it's slavery. Right. So if we follow it today, what does that make us? Still a slave. That's right. We still slave mentally, but we still follow the white man way. We gotta come out of the white man way. Since you got to stop celebrating Mother's Day. Read it again. Beware, lest any man spoil you. So God says, beware. Don't let them spoil you with their philosophy. Hey, bro. We see you out. You out here every week, bro. You selling bean pies to your people on the Sabbath. I know that uh, Islam follow the Bible too. They follow the Bible more than they do the Quran. Hey sis, did you know you're Israelite? Did you know that? You heard that? Hey, let's check this out, man. Hey, check this out. Hey, let's 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 check this out. Hey, we the Israelites. We ain't black, we ain't Hispanic. We the Israelites. That's right. That's right. God's chosen people. Greatest people ever walked the earth. Read. Hey, and vain deceit. Read. And vain deceit. From the top. 
Beware! 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 Really watch out! God is telling you to watch out! What does he want us to watch out for? Come on! Lest any man spoil you! Lest any man spoil you, really? Through philosophy! Through his philosophy! Through man-made philosophies! He said, beware! Come on! And vain deceit! And vain deceit! Why? Beware of the white man lie! He lied to us telling us Christ is white! He lied to us telling us uh, our Savior was born on December 25th! He lied! He lied! He lied! He lied. The white man is a liar. That's right. Read. After the tradition of men. After the tradition of men. He's full of it. He's full of hatred for us. The white man don't love us. He ain't gonna never give us nothing good. We're in the poorest neighborhood. We got the poorest uh, grocery stores. What? We got the worst water in the streets. We still being oppressed. I was sick the day we were brought over here. Ain't nothing changed. Just because they took the chains off our neck. Ain't nothing changed. Read. That's right. After the rudiments of the world. After the rudiments of this world. We follow the rudiments of this world. We follow Mother's Day because the white man told us to. And Mother's Day ain't in the Bible. That's right. So why are we giving them our money? It's a hard month for us. It's a hard month for us for our holiday. All they want to do is take the baby down. Look, they want to take them a drug for the damn stuff. We get drugs for these guys who work there. We ain't allowed to own nothing. We ain't allowed to work for nothing. The white man gonna keep his stuff in our, keep his feel in our lips. Huh. He's gonna keep us at the bottom of society when we come to death. That's we right. He's gonna keep us at the bottom of society. He's gonna keep his feel in our neck. So we come together as a people. So we learn to love each other like we love ourselves. That's come right. On. The book of Zephaniah, chapter 2 and verse 1. Gather yourselves together. Yay! Gather together, O oh nation not desire! Read it again! Gather yourselves together! Yay! Gather together, O oh nation not desire! So the Bible says you so-called blacks and Spanish! Gather yourselves together! What? Gather yourselves together! Stop being divided by language! Stop being divided by neighborhood! That's Stop right! Stop being divided by color! We're the same people! Blacks and Hispanics! We're the Israelites, bro! Get out! That's Hispanics. right! We're the Israelites, bro! We the same people, same people. These uh, lords came over here, colonized this land. That's and right. Bring it up. Still being oppressed. That's why they got speed bumps in our neighborhood. They got these cameras in our neighborhood. Protect us from speed. Anything to take money out of our pockets. Anything to keep us on the bottom of society. Bro. We got to read it again. Gather yourselves together. Yay! Gather together, oh nation, not desire. We're a nation not desire. They kill our young people, not our young people in the streets, bro. Blacks in the space, they've been killing us for years, bro. You gotta come together, win it again. Gather yourselves together. Gather yourselves together, blacks and Hispanics, come on. Yay! Gather together, oh nation, not desire. Why does the most high tell us to gather together? Why? Because right now it's perilous time. And we gotta come together. Y'all don't see it, but it's gonna be a race war. They gonna show their true colors. That's they show right. how bad they truly the hate us. Keep reading. Before the decree break forth. Before the decree break forth. Just they gonna show their true colors and their true hatred for them. That's right. Before the day pass at the time. Before the fierce anger of the Lord. Before Christ comes back, we gotta gather together. Because then we don't gather together under the word of God, under this Bible, Christ gonna put to death. That's right. That's what God better learn. That's why we out here. We out here wake up, people up under the deep this day in. Bring it again. Gather yourselves together. Gather yourselves together, black man. This man. Come on. Yay! Gather together, oh nation not desire. Oh, nation not desire. They kill our children, they kill our women, they kill our men. They've been doing that since they brought us over here. They right there. And they still doing it right. So what do we gotta do? Bring it again. Gather yourselves together! We gotta gather ourselves together. Under this Bible. Under this Bible. That's the only thing that's gonna protect us. The white man don't like us. He don't like us. Read! Yay! Gather together! Oh nation not desire! We the nation not desire! So-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans. We the nation not desire. So we gotta gather ourselves together. We gotta gather ourselves together under God's law and statute command. That's right. It's not a grievous thing to do. It's easy to do. Three of us is out here and we doing it. We doing it. We out trying to make a change in our community. That's right. Ain't nobody else doing it. Ain't nobody That's else right. gonna help us. 
Ain't nobody else gonna help me. Jesus. Give me to the rock. Give me to the rock. Give me to the rock. We are a cursed ass people. And we follow the traditions of this land. This land is promote homosexuality, right? It's promote homosexuality. Is that natural to God? Give me Romans uh, 1 25. Is that natural to God? This land is legalized homosexuality. It's not natural to God. Ain't it natural to God? It's not even natural for a person. How can you reproduce? If we homos, how we gonna reproduce? We'll be extinct. Man was made for woman, woman made for man. Read the book of Romans, chapter 1 and verse 25. Who changed the truth of God into a lie? God said the woman was made for man. Husband and wife, marriage. Who trains that into a lot? They say we can uh, uh, legal, uh, legalize uh, uh, homosexual marriage. That's who trains that to a lot? Read! And worship and serve the creature more than the creator! But now we worship and serve the creature. God made the creature. God made the white man. But we serve the white man more than we serve God. That's right. That's why we worship on Sunday. Because the white man said worship on Sunday. The Bible says worship on Saturday. Why do we serve the creature more than we serve the creator? The creator created you, but yet you give him no love back. Give him no love back. His prophets out here trying to teach you who you are, but you give no love back. That's right. That's you right. want to hear. Read. Who is blessed forever? Amen. Read. For this cause, God gave them up to vile affection. Gave them up to vile affection. A woman and a woman. What look, what kind of be sitting by what be scissoring? How they gonna reproduce? You can't reproduce with woman and woman. You can't reproduce with man and man. That's vile affection. Come on. For even their woman did change the natural use into that which is against nature. It's against nature. The woman was made to reproduce, to bear forth kids, to keep our nation going on. That's what. But he changed our natural use, please. And likewise also, the man, leaving the natural use of the woman. Now a man want to be with a man. What the hell type of sense does that make? It's okay for the white man, because they was doing that since the beginning they was made. During the Greek and Roman times, they have homosexual acts. That's their nature. It's not the nature of the blacks and the Spanish. But yet, we want to follow their tradition. We want to be gay now. No, they not they trying to tell us our kids they can make a decision if they want to be a boy or they want to be a girl. Read 25 again. This world is madness and it's going to be destroyed. Trust and believe that. Come on. Who changed the truth of God into a lie? Who changed the truth of God into a lie? The white man did. That's the white right. man changed the truth of God into a lie. I'm going to say it flat and plain. Read it again. Who changed the truth of God into a lie? Who? The white man did. That's why he got to serve a white Jesus. That's why he got to worship in a white God. He said Jesus is white. When the Bible says he's black. That's right. The Bible says Jesus is black. Read. And worship and serve the creature. So now we're going to worship and serve the creature. How? With Mother's Day. The creature invented Mother's Day. Jeez. And we're serving the creature. We don't give a damn about our creator. We don't give a damn about it. Read. More than the Creator! More than the Creator! He created heaven and earth and everything on this earth. Every animal, every bird, every beast, every creepy thing. But yeah, we want to serve the white man. We serve the white man because we don't know who he is and we let him name us. That's right! We let him give us the uh, African American. We let him give us that. We serve the white man and not our God. We got the one true living God. And we gotta come back to him. He's black and Spanish. We gotta come back to him once you live to That's right. That's right. Read. Who is blessed forever? Amen. The, the creator is the only one blessed forever. And the only way we're gonna be blessed is to come back to who we are talking about. That's right. You are not a black man. You are not a Spanish man. You are an Israelite. God right. chose the people. Come on, That's sir. who you are. Did you know you're an Israelite brother? Give me all. Come on over here, sis. Hey Jim, let me talk to you. Because we think we're going to go out and we're going to do this and we're going to do that and we're going to be able to live great. We're going to get up out of society, get 
doing it that way. We are gonna clear up our community doing it that way. There's only one thing that's gonna get us out of the condition that we in. Read the book of Joshua, chapter one and verse eight. Read this book of the law shall not depart out of thy mouth. So the book of the law is not gonna be part out of our mouth. We are gonna come out here and we are gonna teach the sin of the law to you so-called black and Hispanic. We all get it right. Tell the one third wake up. Tell the elect wake up. And when the elect wake up, then Christ is coming back. That's right. And he's going to come back with death on his mind. He's going to kill everybody that's out of order. Read. But thou shalt meditate therein day and night. We're going to meditate therein day and night on this Bible. We're going to follow this Bible. We're going to eat, sleep, and teach this Bible. That's right. That's right. That thou mayest observe to do according to all that is written. We're going to do everything that's written in this Bible. We ain't celebrating on Mother's Day because you won't bring in the Bible. We ain't celebrating December 25th because you won't bring in the Bible. We ain't celebrating Easter because you won't bring in the Bible. That's right. We ain't celebrating Father's Day because you won't bring in the Bible. Read. There it. For then thou shalt make thy way prosperous. When we come back to the most high God way, we going to make us prosperous. That's he right. He raises up from the bottom and put us on top. But we got to come back to him. We have to come back to him. Of the Lord. We can't speak and lead to our own understanding. Get that in Proverbs 3 and 5. We want to think we're going to get ourselves out of poverty. We want to think we're going to get ourselves out of the ghetto. We want to think we're going to get ourselves out of the conditions we're living in. But that's not what's going to get us out of the conditions. That's not what's going to change. We are going to Proverbs chapter 3 and verse 5. Trust in the Lord with all thine heart. So we're going to trust in the Lord with all our heart. Come on. And lean not unto thine own understanding. We don't think with our own mind like what's good and what's bad. We know what's good. God's law. That's, that's what's good. Read. In all thy ways acknowledge him, and he shall direct thy path. He go, hey, when we acknowledge God as being our higher being, and I'm going to like his son, he's going to direct our way. He's going to direct us. We ain't got to think for ourselves, because the Bible going to teach us how to walk. The Bible going to teach us how to talk. That's the Bible right. teach us how to eat. The Bible will teach us how to live. Read. Be not wise in thy own eyes. Don't think that you're wise in your own eyes. That's why you're not going to get out of your condition by doing the things you want to do. God said, follow his commandments, then he'll make the cross. That's right. Keep his commandments, then he'll make the cross. That's right. That's the only way we're going to get out of the condition. I don't care what condition we in. It don't matter. You gotta, you gotta recognize God as the higher being and come back to him. First, you gotta know who you is. You know your Israelite brother? You know your Israelite? God's chosen people. What is the nation? Nation is family. Nation is community. Nation is men leading by example. Nation is women's support. Nation is children with role models. Nation is unity. Nation is 